Hello everybody, I am Brentman19 and welcome to episode 20 of our Maratha campaign in Empire Total War. And technically I think we're India because uh, it looks like the Indian flag there. So what we're doing is we're getting ready to use our Marathan rebels here to take over the capital, <laughs> Santara. It's 414 versus 180. I mean, come on. I mean, they're using armed peasantry against armed peasantry, Hindu musketeers, and general's bodyguard. So let's go ahead and assault. Even with their walls, they're not going to be able to stop us, I don't think. I'm about to have a little bit of fun here in how I position troops, I think. Depends on what they let me do. Yes, okay. I'm going to put Landless Rabble off over here. Here we go. Um, one, two, three. All right where they need to be. Okay, in deployment. You're going there. You're going there. You're going right there. You. I'm going to have climb up right here. And the reason I'm having that is he's just going to come walk in and take this territory in case things go utterly bad for me. So let's fast forward, let things work. I think it's funny how we now have like a green thing around us like to let us know like hey this is actually your units now these are your allies these guys are your bad guys you're used to fighting the other way around and if that's always been there I've never noticed it but I'm just telling you that's it looks like a first for me yeah we have no choice but to fight with melee on this one He's got a little bit longer to run. Still fresh. The second he says active, I'm going to jump him off. Oh, he did it for himself. All right. Here we go. Climbing up. 60 on 60. No, oh, it's alright. These guys are coming up unopposed. Yeah, he got completely destroyed himself. We almost got all of our boys up. go kill their general. I think we've actually probably destroyed them. Yeah, they're completely done. We didn't even have to use those guys. Rogue victory! And the revolution succeeds. Bijapur, the capital has fallen to revolutionary forces. The old order has been removed and its leading members publicly executed. A fitting end and an example to those who would plunge us back into tyranny. And as you know, can see, I like how they changed up the, the back. You know, this ends here. So you can actually see, like, you know, you got different endings and such. All right. So we're now the, um, I think we are, what are we called exactly? Let's go to diplomatic relations. We're the Maratha Confederacy still. We're just a republic. So. Not bad. Thought they would name us, like, India. And the people are, like, super happy about this. Uh, so in that case, first... Fix up these buildings. I don't need those people around. Clamor for reform will start going down on its own. I might go bring these guys to there, but that's about it. 
Um, I will put trade policy back on. War was declared between Spain and Poland and Lithuania. Let's look and see if I can get any... Is there anybody else? No, we're all good. Everybody turned hostile, though. Just because of who we, you know... Just because of what we are now. This agent here. I want you to go here. Alright, anything that needs to be done. Nope, not through there. That's about to be done as a warehouse. I don't have anything there to worry about. Glacial estate. Another warehouse. Thing down here is just fine. This can go on to a cotton warehouse. Let's see, up here. That's just being a tea warehouse, that's being a palatial estate. This right here can go on to be a tea warehouse. Palatial estate. That area is done. Next, I'll probably have to come in here and do this one. I'm trying to get a town built here. Okay, um, I think we're good. Again, you tick off half the world by being, be, you know, changing your government type. Maybe the Ottomans won't want to work with me anymore. So. At least that annoying piece will be over with. No declaration of wars yet. I'm also not bordering anybody at the same time. Alright, we're just taking our sweet time, I guess. That's fine. Venice. Again, I would love to have been friends with those folks. Trading partners. Been nice. There is a port in this region that has not yet been developed. Select the type. Okay. Um, technology. Did get citizenship. How's that turn policy wise? Yeah, a lot of places are turned off. A couple of my big places are turned off. Like you could be turned back on. You could be turned back on. Okay, you need to report to this army. Yep, you could be done there. You could be done there. I mean, we're ready to fight on the as far as those fronts go. Let's look and do... Seek Musketeers. Ooh. I could replace units. Is there a certain amount? Nope. They have better accuracy than Burger. That might be something we need to look into doing. Just replacing all of my armies. Um, you guys have done well, but you need to be disbanded. Um, still focusing on my economy, though. That's never going to be. It's a never-ending thing. Cordoba and Barar. That's fine. That is a tea warehouse. 
Let's do this one right here. Palatial Estate. I guess I need to go ahead and do Hindustan up here. Since we're going inland. Really? Oh, here they are up here. Um, not the Palatial Estate, so definitely need to go ahead and get... Well, Sugar Warehouse. Yeah, Cotton. Sugar. Palatial Estate. Then we'll do this one. Well, getting the tea done is a big deal. Is there anything else up here? Hmm. Nothing else. Not by the looks of it. Alright, in the turn. I think around 1750 uh, is when I'm going to do this attack. I'm going to change out my armies and all that at the same time. Look <laughs> at all those guys just moving forward. That might give Persia enough time to start on Jordan or something. And also give me enough time to get my army completely switched over. Do want them? To, I'm hoping Persia is going after like Jordan and stuff like that. I can't see that down there in between turns because that's not where our trade route runs through. Not like there's Baghdad did. This region that has not yet been developed. Select the type of port to construct here. A fishing port will help your population grow. A trade port will provide an income from overseas trade. Okay. Um. Natural causes on a general here. Was rather unfortunate, but people die. Um, that's going to palatial. So this play area will be done. Um, this one will be done. Let's look around here. Palatial, palatial, palatial. Palatial up there is done. Um, palatial. I mean, that looks like that's all of them. If I'm not mistaken. That's everything done, except for you know these places that you know, like this one, the large cotton plantation, the you know large tea plantation. Okay, um, if that's the case, Let's recruit a general. All right, and then let's go recruiting ten. Oh well, hey, wait, 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 pull them out. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So nine Seek Musketeers in this next turn. Yeah, this place, these places are going to change out quick. Um... We're making 23,000 a turn. Probably most of it from trade. It's the first time I've really actually worked on plantations like that.
And everybody in the game is going to want my trade. You know, that's why, you know, everybody's hostile. But it's like, well, if we don't take his trade, we don't get that tea. We don't get that cotton. We don't get that, you know, sugar and anything else I've got growing. Which is why like, the Italian states need to be rethinking their ideas there. There is a port in this region that has not yet been developed. Select the type of port to construct here. A fishing port will help your population grow. A trade port will provide an income. These guys are blocking each other's paths. Alright, nation destroyed the Pueblo. Execute they, one of my agents was executed. New nation of Quebec has arisen. Let's go talk to... Let's see about Quebec. Where are you at? They're indifferent to us. Actually, Venice, Venice is very friendly because of our Republic status, I'm sure. If I opened it, request trade, gave a payment of like... 4,000, would you do it? No. Quebec, though, I'd like to trade with you. Again, Quebec... There you go. Nice little cash influx will help you. There you go. I've got a trade agreement with Venice now. Okay. All our friends. Um, your recruitment. We had brought in nine, so one, two... Three, four, five, six more. That should be 15. All right. Where are they coming from? Back of the line somewhere? I don't know. I don't see them. Where are they? I can't find it. Oh, here they are. They're coming out of Hindustan. Um, is there anything I can do about these? Commercial port. Commercial port. Commercial basin. Commercial port. Commercial port. Next time I come through, I'll do this one. I'm pretty sure, yeah, T Warehouse, I was all good on. I'll do this one next for commercial port. That'll extend more trade power. And then I'll turn around and uh, I might let the game start developing some more stuff. See, nothing really happening by Persia on our end. Maybe they're having a hard time with Syria and Baghdad. Or maybe they're pushing on Turkey there itself and I just don't see it. That has not yet been developed. Select the type of port to construct here. A fishing port will help your population grow. A trade okay. port will provide an income from overseas trade. Hindustan and Rajputunia. Allows the construction of warships. 3825 there. In Hindustan, there's Cotton Warehouse. Yeah, see, I'm already at the highest I can get there. I'm 
Well, how much is trade? Like I'm, I'm pulling that. I mean, I'm pulling up tons, but trade income is like twelve thousand. Tax income is like nineteen. It's just getting higher too. Yes, sir. So we got those five. Those five. Those five. And those five. Good. All right. Um. We take these guys out. Nothing bad happened. Yes. I want him gone. I want all of them gone. Recruitment. Seek musketeers. One, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. How about here. I can pull those men out too. Um, get you rid of. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. It's all good. Um, I guess I filled up the slots. Yeah, no slot available to build them in, I guess. Um, Yeah, we're not drawing recruitment from down here. Of course, apparently I can't seem to build them down here despite where I'm at. Oh, 4,000 is what it costs. Okay. Um. Alright, I think we're going to end it right here. But next time, we'll sh we should be attacking. Uh, we have too many. You know, as soon as I get these three armies up to, par you know, up to par, and they're at 20 apiece... They're gonna be they're gonna be jumping into Baluchistan and uh, into Afghanistan, and the third one will keep on walking up here to Persia, and we'll be taking over this stuff. I might even just declare war on the Ottomans to uh, ensure that we have an easier time with it. Anybody that we're are we still hostile with everybody? Different government type is gonna be there for a while. Great Britain, we're friendly with. We're friendly with Poland. We are hostile with them, but I'm pretty... Are they going to... Nope, they won't even trade, take the trade deal. Unfriendly with Spain. Again, it's just different government type. We were great with everybody before. So hopefully over time it'll fix itself up. So, alright guys, appreciate y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. Maybe check out the link for Discord in the description below. And I'll see you all next time.